Alright, lately I've been trying to find the ideal setup for these 1407 motors and 3 inch props. I'm running the 3200 kV right now. And uh, I tried the 3030 bullnose. I was not very impressed with their performance. So now I'm trying the uh, these are 3030 tri blades, the Rotor X ones. And I think I'm also going to try some uh, HQ 3030 uh, two blades. They're a little bigger than 3 inch, so we'll see how they do. Just going to take a quick video of this to see how this one performs. Ooh! <laughs> Might even be able to take right off. That worked out. Probably should be reducing the P gains here, that looks we're getting some vibration, but... Beans a little bit. <laughs> ah. Battery's going to probably be cooking anyway. Didn't even bend the prop though. Sweet. Alright, earlier I was running the uh, Rotor X3030 tri blades on this setup. Now I'm going to give a shot to the uh, HQ. This is just a two bladed 3030. A little bigger, but we've only got two props. Uh, Pretty good, but lots of air slip. More than I would really like for an acro or line of sight build. Kind of heavy for those three inch props. I mean, it has good pat, but it's definitely flown better. Alright, now I'm going to try this same setup. I've got some of these Diatone 3x4.5 props on. And, uh, these are the bullnose, the standard 3030 bullnose were not very good, so we'll see how these do.
loud. They're better than the 3030s, but I still think the uh, tri blades are the best. They're yeah, just not very fast. <laughs> Not very good stopping power either. Battery's gotta be heating up good now. <sighs> Battery is hot. Everything is hot. This is just a, not a good setup. 3030 tries are way better for that.